Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. This is Reverend Dr. Idikai Mary. I welcome you to Thanksgiving 2018. I welcome you. I want to use this opportunity to thank each and every one of you that did the most important things on the end this year. You followed God. You represented your family. You provided for them. I am so proud, very proud of you. You stayed in the presence of the Almighty God. You worked very hard to take care of your family. I am very proud of you. I stand here today to celebrate you and to tell you thank you. Thank you for partnering with me. Thank you for standing with you and with your family to make good things happen in this world. Thank you very much. In this atmosphere of gratefulness and gratitude, an elevation of happiness to the highest standard, I thank you and I thank God. I come into your home to dedicate this thanksgiving of today to the Holy Spirit. That's why we are read still today. Because today also marks the beginning of our 2018 camp meeting, prayer camp meeting. It begins today and it will end on December 28th. It is the time that you have to make up your mind to wrap up this year and to wrap up next year. It is the time for special miracles in your life. Opportunity God has given to you, privilege for you to walk and to show off your power. It is a time that the Holy Spirit is going to show off his power. This year's camp prayer camp meeting is called, it is called Spirit Prayer Conference 2018 and it begins today. I want to invite you to accompany me during this time. Call me, give me a call or email me. If you live outside the United States and Canada, email me. So that I can audio mp3 you. I can send you audio mp3s. Because I'm going to be blessing people. Making pronouncements. The pronouncement I was talking about all these past weeks. Is going to happen beginning from today. When you call me. Attach the sum of $100. Or whatever. The, the, the highest, the best giving you can give. For the work of ministry. And also for the work of supporting pastors out there. I'm looking for used tablet, iPad, laptops to send to pastors all over the earth who write to me. I want you to send your gift certificate and financial contribution to families who are looking up to me to be a blessing to them this Christmas. Thank you. So, every day, today is day one, every day you receive a video on YouTube and other places on Justin TV. Livestream.com, Daily Motion. You will receive a video, a video that talks about the topic for the day, and there will be massive explosion of miracles after that. There will be many stretch, and it will be very short. So, in this spirit, I invite you not to waste your life the remaining part of the year. Join me to wrap up this year and to escalate things in the supernatural and in the mind and in the physical and the financial realm. Everything you've been struggling with, let's escalate it to the highest point. This is Dr. Idikai Mary of Idikai Mary's Ministry welcoming you today to special Thanksgiving. Please send these videos to your friend, to your family because there will be prayer for miracles. In this prayer, let us pray. Eternal Father, 
thank you very much for giving us the opportunity to see today. We thank you for all that you've done for us throughout this year. We are grateful and we appreciate you. Amen. I'm going to read to you from I'm going to read to you from Psalm 118. Psalm 118, from verse 1. Hear the word of the living God. Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. His love, or his steadfast love, is forever, or endureth forever. Let Israel, or the church, say, let you say his mercy or his love endures forever. Let the house of Aaron say your own house. His love endures forever. Let those who fear the Lord say his love endures forever ever hmm. I want to stop there I want to stop there that is our read from verse 1 to verse number 4 thankfulness is not a weakness it is a strength Thankfulness is one of the highest powers in the supernatural realm. It defeats demons. It destroys obstacles. A grateful person is a powerful person. Today, one of my highest supporters in ministry from England sent me an uncommon Send to the ministry an uncommon gift. She always sends an uncommon gift. I was ecstatic. I always rejoiced over her. She is a mighty woman of valor. Day before yesterday, another highest supporter of my ministry, of our ministry from Florida, she sent an uncommon gift, sending books to, to help me grow. Another uncommon supporter of this ministry from Hawaii. She, she, she is every way to make the ministry stand. Another uncommon supporter of the ministry from Austin. From Atlanta, Georgia. Another uncommon supporter of the ministry from Switzerland. And then there are so many of you out there. The one in D.C., the people in, in, in Montreal, Toronto, people, I mean, uncommon supporter in Washington State. I mean, if I begin to mention names, I will not end because I just want this thing to be short. I am so thankful and appreciative of each of you for being there for your family, for working hard and you did not give up hope. I want to say to you, thank you. Uncommon supporters in Wisconsin, uncommon supporters in Mississippi, in New York State, I mean everywhere. I see single mamas being there for their children. And supporting them. It thrills me. Because my mom was there when my father was long gone. With eight of us. Working hard to put food on the table. To put a roof over our head. 
I want to thank each and every one of you for leaving your home every day and go to work. And those of you who have your, or your, your business right there in your home or outside your home for going out there and making sure there is food on the table, there's gas in the car, there's a tithe to be sent, there's a roof over, over the heads of you and the kids. Thank you. I want to thank I want to thank those in Kansas, those in North Carolina, those in South Carolina, Maryland, Virginia. My strong supporters are there. I want to thank you. Many of you of Indian origin, many of you of Haitian origin, many of you from Asia, Malaysia, those of you in Europe. I want to thank you. We thank you, Lord, for you are good. It has not been your own work alone. The power and the spirit of God was behind it all. I want to use this opportunity to thank you for what you have done for humanity. Being there for all of us. Thanksgiving produces power that generates influence that makes wonderful things to happen. In this Thanksgiving, I am going to you Thanksgiving to pray for mighty things to happen to you more and more. Thanksgiving for your elevation. Thanksgiving. This is a prayer of thanksgiving to promote you. Thanksgiving. Prayer of thanksgiving to promote your life. Prayer of thanksgiving to promote your life. Worship of thanksgiving to promote your life. Ha! Let's pray. In the name of Jesus, I want you to touch my hand. Let the power of God surround you. Let there be today that people are thankful. Let this thanksgiving become the power that God uses to manifest generosity towards you and your family and your business and your job. And silence Satan forever. And silence demons forever in your life. I command every demons of affliction in your life to come out and leave you forever and ever in Jesus' name. I speak promotion. I speak the blessing. I speak abundance into your life as you are blessed me and you have blessed your children and you have blessed the people of god you have worked for the kingdom of god god begins to work for you and the word that i am pronouncing from my mouth will not return to me void it must accomplish that which i am sending it to you today I pronounce upon you the mercy, the favor of God that endure it forever. It will never leave you from this day forward. Hallelujah. The Almighty God begin to pour into you the spirit of understanding and wisdom and ability and agility, vitality, virility. Thank you, Holy Spirit. As we dedicate from today, November 28, to December 28, to you, Holy Spirit, come among us and do massive miracles. Let testimonies abound everywhere. In Jesus' name, amen. I release divine healing and miracles and supernatural abundance and flow into your life now and forever. Amen.
God bless you. This is Idika Imeri's Ministries. And I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Call me, 316-765-0060 or 316-243-2967. Email me at idikaimeri2000, that's idikaimeri2000, at gmail.com. I look forward, I am available for you. It is the greatest power God has given to me. Is being there for you to be a blessing to you. I am speaking this to a lady in California. You are preparing for your law exam. You are going to be called to bar and you will end up being a high court judge. Mark my word, I'm speaking it now. There is a massive opportunity for you to become a wonderful model all over the world in a Christian way. And for you, there is a lady I'm talking to. You are going to have your, your cosmetic brand. That's what I've been shown. There is someone that I'm looking at. At your age, you think it's over. You are entering into the millionaire club. God is raising people to become multi-millionaires through my ministry, through our ministry. And you are part of it. There is somebody who had a kidney failure. God is giving you a new kidney right now. Yes. There's somebody who has, you have a cast, a white cast over your neck. The Almighty God is healing you right now. Father, I thank you for this wonderful opportunity. I thank you for this miracle that you are doing this day in Jesus' mighty name. There is somebody who has been crying because you are looking for a new job. A job that will be a blessing. A job has come to visit you and you are walking right into that job. You are going to visit uh, somewhere, but you do not know that that is going to be your job. There is somebody who is sitting on the park right now. I don't know which park. I don't know where it is, but that's just what I'm told to say. And you are going to meet another woman who is going to open a door for you that will never end and that will never close. Many of you are having special open doors right now. God be with you and God bless you. Amen.